Rosie Hardy Gardening here. Today I'm going to do a video on my top five plants which are small plants so therefore ones for the front of the garden or for in containers depending on how you garden. By definition I mean small plants ones that are a foot so 30 centimeters and below maybe just touching 40 centimeters but that is what I am classifying as being the small plants for this video. Let's start off with a plant which a lot of people will know and grow and this is what used to be sedum, Hylotelephium. This one is Hylotelephium lidocensi. It has beautiful arching branches and it stays low. It may spread sideways but its height is actually quite low. It's very very good for in a container because once it has put on its flowers at the end of here these can hang down so they look really good or very good on the edge of a border in paving uh, on the side of gravel gardens that type of thing they make lovely mounds probably out to 45 50 centimeters sideways no more than about 25 to 30 centimeters height wise full sun if you want something that is really low and is not going to get much taller than it is here in this pot which is probably about two inches maybe six to ten centimeters in height then this beautiful little pratia pendunculata is your person and they are brilliant they just are spreaders and they have little runners that run around and just carpet the ground completely so they are ideal for naturalizing into grassland areas or running through gravel paths just really really low with this fabulous pale blue flower loads and loads of flower semi evergreen you will always see roughly where the patch is easy to divide sun or part shade and they are really lovely little plants really really low you could put them in an alpine trough but remember they're going to run quite a lot um, and you would have to be taking them out all the time but shallow rooted so that is pratia pendunculata then one of the really sweet low growing thalictrums is this beautiful thalictrum, thalictrum quesianum. Lovely fluffy heads on here, masses of buds still to come. Foliage is really hugging the ground. Again, this is a mat forming plant. It's running around at the base there and it just looks fabulous at this time of the year. So we're just coming into early summer and it's great for woodland shady areas just into sun it doesn't want to be in full sun all the time and it's not going to get much taller than six to eight inches 20 centimeters high but it's going to go to about 45 centimeters round so a really good low front of border shady border or underneath trees and shrubs the lictrum quesianum now things which are a little bit taller but are small for their species, this is a salvia. This is salvia nemorosa and this one is rose improved and this is a short stature salvia. So this is sort of to my limit of what I am calling small. So this is going to be around about 35 to 40 centimeters maximum with its flowers, lovely foliage and covered in these wonderful dark bracts, purple bracts, and then this lovely pink rose colored flowers coming out. So you've always got this combination of color on here. This is good for the front of the border, strong stems, full sun, free draining soil, really easy. You don't have to stake it. Once it has finished flowering, you can give it a haircut. It will come back up with a second flush of flower for you. And it's something that can be divided. So that is a really good form. And the last of my top five is this beautiful Campanula. This is a Campanula glomerata. Now, normally glomeratas are much taller, but this one, Caroline, with this lovely soft flower here, so soft 
I don't know what you call it, lilac into purple because when it's first coming out in bud it's got quite a dark purple edge to the buds and then it fades to this purple. You have a lovely big head and then flowers coming lower and lower here. Again this is going to get to my optimum height of about 40 centimetres. It will spread, you can see it's a spreader so it's making a lovely clump so it's really good for the front of the border, sun to part shade and a divisible plant. Thank you very much for watching and please do subscribe to the channel.